Megan MacArthur, who worked the arm and grappled the telescope. Scott Altman, our commander, who flew the space shuttle in uh, formation with the telescope, going how fast? 17,500 miles an hour. Very fast. Formation. Very, very fast. Just like this. Unbelievable. So, Megan, how do you feel? What was it like? I feel good. You know, it was uh, it was very smooth. It was very straightforward. The scooter got the, uh, really nulled out all the rates. It was just rock solid. It was like grabbing something that wasn't moving. So I uh, felt good. Glad to have that behind us so the EBA guys can get to work. Now you're going to make us work. See, exactly. Then, yeah, you're you're good up till then. <laughs> but that, that's, it did look like a statue, that telescope, didn't it? Yeah, it was Look, beautiful. it was moving at all. Yeah, it was awesome. You did a great, but well, you were happy after you grabbed that thing, uh, weren't yeah. you? Yeah. yeah, that was the big. That was a big challenge for you, wasn't it? Well, it was. It was good. It went yeah. uh, just like clockwork. All right, well, that's great. And scooter, sir. What about you? What did you think of the rendezvous? How was it? It was exciting. What you said? The challenge was there. You said it was a little fast. Is that right? We came in. Uh, we had kind of uh, a little extra closure, a little out of plane maneuvering, uh, yeah. trying to get up to the telescope. We had to do some braking, and then the telescope wasn't rotated uh, for us. We had to wait. When we got there, and then do a yaw maneuver. All this. Oh my gosh! Look at that. See, it's just a ball with that telescope. Gosh! But you are an F-14 pilot, right? Yes. So going fast, that's not a big deal. That was all right. That was okay. And it was just like the sim. It was a lot like the sim. Yes. I was glad we had that last orbit sim, or we did the yaw at the wrong time, so that on this time yeah. we could do the yaw at the right time. Do you think your Top Gun flying helped you with this, you know, in that movie that you did? Well, this, I do, because see, a... we're, we're like this. We're going around. It's sort of inverted like that. We right. Negative G pushover right. with the telescope at yeah. 18,000 miles an hour. Right. What do you think of that? Unbelievable. We've never been this close before. No. All right. Well, both of you, it's a pleasure to be on the same crew with you guys, and uh, awesome job today. All right. You get to work. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear you say it. Yeah. And what are you doing tomorrow with them? These are our EVA and space walking uh, tool caddies called mini workstations. They have our tethers on them so we don't lose things. We can tether to stuff. There we go. We have our EVA trash bag to put little things. I'm not going to touch these very delicate right. bristles. Right, there it is. Yes, very delicate. We always check to make sure it's closed in the right. back. Right, when it's zipped in the back as a yeah. zipper. That's good. What do you got there, Drew? Drew's got some fun stuff. This is stuff. our uh, safety tether. Right. You, and, you, uh, you always got to have that on you. You got to have these on. This is Show the, the real end. This is the way it comes out, the real. The, there the you go. It keeps us attached to the vehicle, right. of course, you're, we don't let go. Right. You're always going to have that on you. You're not going to let go anyway. It's just in case. Your wire is all that protects us from flying away. No, you guys have other techniques Very and stuff to help you. We don't let go. Right. You'll be fine. So how do you guys feel? Drew, Yeah. this is your first space walk tomorrow. What do you feel? What I'm do you excited. think? I'm excited. I'm getting excited. Yeah. You're ready. Seeing, seeing Hubble come into the payload bay was pretty amazing. Yeah. And, um, the rendezvous was fun, and now we're ready to go. We're getting it, off. It was beautiful, wasn't it? Work. Yeah. Yeah, I can amazing. tell you, man. You're ready to go. You're going to do great. I'm ready. Thanks, buddy. Awesome, man. And John, this is like spacewalk number 714? No. Spacewalk number six. six. Okay, yep. great. I'm looking forward to seeing our old friend Hubble, the space telescope. Yeah. Yeah, seeing if it's aged at all. I know I have. A little gray in the mustache here, but uh, I'm, I'm really looking forward to going out and putting in the wide field camera. What's wide field camera going to do? I unlock the secrets of the universe. That's unlock right. The unlock the, the secrets, unlock of, the secrets of the universe. Of the universe. That's right. right. Okay, well, Hubble did look pretty good. I have to admit, it came in. I looked at those handrails there in the survey, John. Yeah, the I think you're going to be pleased. Yeah. You guys are going to do great. You're all set, ready to go. Tools are ready. Wish you the best of luck. We're going to be there with you, talking to you from the inside. And uh, here we go. Spacewalk can start tomorrow morning. Yeah. Awesome. All right, Mike Good. You're very, you're very involved with that rendezvous today, weren't you? Well, I had a very small pit roll. Well, I, what but, were you uh, doing? Tell us what you were doing. I was uh, shooting the, heli the telescope as it was coming in with yeah. my handheld laser. Yeah. And uh, that gives us range and range rate, how fast the, uh, how far away the telescope is from us, and how fast we're approaching it. And I got the new record today for Hubble, over 4,400 feet, thanks to Alan Fox, my instructor. He really right. uh, did a great job. So what that means is you were able to get a distance measurement by shooting that laser yeah. from 4,400 feet. Can you imagine? I don't Who think knows? there's any state trooper in a country that can fire a laser <laughs> like that. And, and come on, you got not just the range, but the speed on it, too, right? Yeah, it was going really slow, though. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs>
17,500 no, miles both, an hour. We're both going very fast, right, but so the relative, relative speeds, speeds uh, but it was very, very exciting. I was very happy to get that. Now, 4,400 feet, what was the previous record? It was like uh, 25 feet or something like that, right? <laughs> These guys, what's it was the around 4,000, so I think anything 4, over 4,000 was a new record, but nobody remembers, so I got the record. I got a feeling now, since we've got <laughs> this on tape, people are going to remember. Yeah. Yeah. And this is the world record. No one's going to dispute it. There we Congratulations. Go. Thanks, Mike. Good job, Mike. Oh, he's going to ask a question. Mass, what's up? Hey, man, we're floating around the mid-deck. We got you guys set for your EVA tomorrow. Grab the telescope. We're having a good time here. Yeah. Hey, Mass, you want some M&Ms? Thanks very much. Hey, what what'd you think of that rendezvous? What did I think? Were you on the flight deck? I was on the flight deck taking pictures and photos, and my job was to, uh, yeah, yeah. sorry, he remembered. I would probably yeah. eat them up. And uh, my job was to help Megan, who did a great job, yeah. uh, work the arm and back her up and help her out a little bit. But she did great. And then you got some good pictures afterwards of the telescope. We got to take pictures a look at? before. Yeah, I got to move the arm around, some yeah. funky arm positions to look at the different solar array joints, and uh, yeah, it was a blast. I enjoyed it. Fantastic. You guys yeah. are sending us out the door tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, the highlights for me is going to be seeing you guys go out <laughs> tomorrow. Mike and I will be in there keeping keeping watch over you and. Uh, Trying to keep things moving, but we're looking forward to watching you guys spacewalk, like spacemen. Yeah, great. We'll, see, right. we'll see you later. All right. Here we today for you. The rendezvous was not as expected completely. Really? Yes. Yeah, we expected to get to Hubble, right? We did. So that part of it, Hubble. that part of it worked out. I didn't expect to fly out to do the, no. the uh, right. orbit body off fly out. So that was a, that was moving the orbit around, right. and getting the right attitude. A little, little more maneuvering than you thought, a little but more maneuvering. But still, uh, still, it was a. Uh, and also didn't expect the uh, for scooter's camera to be a line that I'd be all washed oh out God. in the light. So a few unexpected a things. A little unexpected. But, however, if, if you look outside that window, I see Hubble. There's a telescope <laughs> out there. So I would say you did a pretty good job. It was good. It was uh, it was good. I did a couple of the burns, yeah. uh, the out of plane null burn, and a couple right. of the correction burns, but okay. those were fun, and then uh, once we got to Hubble, right. Megan did just a rock solid great. job yeah. of getting it with you, and then uh, yeah. got out, got it in the sunlight, and yep. uh, got the survey done of the Hubble, and right. I also took the IMAX of the bird. Oh my goodness, we've got IMAX footage. We've got IMAX 30 millimeter, baby. Well, I know, Greg, is if you look out there, there's a telescope waiting for us to start working on it, so all in all, a good day. I have to say, it's not really what do you have to say? I have to say now, yeah. it's all up to you. Okay, we're going to cut that part of the film. <laughs> See you later.